Hi everyone, welcome back to Guitar Image YouTube channel. All right, today we are so excited and happy because version 3.0 of the Line 6 Hitchhack Storm is finally out. So yeah, right now from six blocks, we can do eight blocks in total. So there's like two extra blocks for you. And if you have always been limited by six blocks, okay, now it's your chance to get two more blocks. However, do watch the DSP. Um, most of the newer stuff requires heavy DSP, especially all the poly stuff. Okay, so what I'm going to do today is I'm just going to quickly run through some of the new sounds that's available in this update. And let's see what are the, some of the cool stuff that you can do uh, with this version 3.0. Okay, so here we have some patches that I've quickly created. And these are of course not finalized patch, it's just to hear how some of the sounds uh, that you know this new version can provide okay so the first thing we want to do is to check out the acoustic simulator okay that is provided under the eq section okay so here what i'm doing is uh i have everything off on my pedal board including my m simulator so there's nothing on okay so here's the acoustic simulator without anything turned on okay we have a delay block and a reverb block on as uh just to provide some ambience <music> Some strumming. Wow, very cool. Suddenly your electric guitar can be an acoustic instrument as well. Let's try with uh, the uh, M simulator and IR turn on. So I have the Iridium on my board, so I'm going to turn that on. And let's see how the acoustic simulator would sound. Okay, so same thing. as well but you can hear that it's going a little bit more to the electric guitar kind of a sound so i prefer to turn the uh my iridium off okay next thing we'll talk about is this uh new feature called the poly couple very cool idea uh it's a virtual kind of a couple you don't have to tune your guitar down uh, it just acts as a virtual couple something like the variax is able to detune the entire guitar down by half step one step entirely up to your choice okay so I'm going to turn that on, let's check it out, okay? So this is the original key. I'm going to move it down half step. Very cool, right? So you can even bring it up like two, three steps. Let's try three step now. Very nice. Okay, so this first patch, just check out the acoustic simulator and the poly couple. Okay, so let's go for our next patch. We're going to check out the new delays that's provided. Okay, so we have a 
poly sustain and we have a glitch delay so let's check out the glitch delay i think it's pretty cool okay i'm gonna on my m simulator and all that stuff now okay so the glitch delay turn on It sounds like a pretty cool sequencer, some a, a little bit like Strymon, like 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 Sky kind of a, a kind of a sound, and uh, I think it's very nice if you can loop this sound over and over again, and yeah, it can be a nice cool backing track, and you can solo over. Okay, so that's the glitch delay. Of course, there are many settings to feed around. Uh, do try them out. Okay, play around with it. Okay, let's check out the poly sustain. So the poly sustain works like that. Uh, when you basically is off, okay. So you need to strum a chord or something, and then you step on the pol uh, the switch to activate the poly sustain, and then you create like a pet sound for you, okay. So it, it can be a, a mom momentary switch or it can be a, just a foot switch. All right. So in this case, you just set it to a foot switch, and then let's see how it sounds. So it's turned off right now, okay. So I'm going to play something. I can solo over it. Yeah, so you hear that? Uh, it, it you can play a chord and then you just you just uh, activate the switch and it just infinite kind of a sustain like a pet sound, and you can just jam over it. You can play many scales over a similar chord and have fun with that. A cool idea to practice your modes on top of a power chord, just uh, right. What I did just now. Okay, so that's uh the delays that's given. Okay. Uh, next we're gonna check out the drive okay so there's a new drive that, that they tr they're thrown in a couple of actually quite a few uh over uh, overdrive and fuss uh but i'm just going to check out the horizon drive and let's see how that sounds okay <laughs> okay so this is the horizon drive <laughs> So that is the Horizon Drive. Okay, next I'm going to play around with the Poly Wham. Okay, so this is your typical Wham thing whereby you know you can play with your uh, vo expression pedal. So that's pretty cool, something cool. So let's check it out. So I'm going to turn on the Poly Wham right now. I have my foot 
pedal on the floor so you can't see it but you know right now it's at zero okay so i'm going to put it at position zero so you can hear that So pretty exciting kind of a feature that you can do your solo, uh, give a full octave uh, jump and come back. You can octave in any direction you like. And that's something cool about the poly wham. Okay, so pretty interesting. Uh, again, very heavy DSP usage. Uh, you probably can do a lot of other things in a chain. Okay, all right. So don't expect the HX Storm to be able to handle all this heavy processing. Okay, uh, you probably can only have a couple more blocks, you know, if you use this kind of, uh, use the poly uh, wham or the pitch and stuff like that. All right, so just one, one more last one. Okay, uh, is a poly pitch. So this one, basically you can, again, set the interval to plus one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, to 12 or even negative. And I think this is pretty good for like lead lines and stuff like that. So you can try it out. This is going to on my sunset right now. Okay, so uh, again, these are things that we uh, look forward so much and want to give Line 6 a big shout out. Uh, thank you for always putting a customer first and giving us consistent, constant updates, new features and listening to the customer on their demands and stuff like that. And with 8 blocks, honestly, uh, this HX Storm has... You know, it's going to the next level. We can do so much more with 8 blocks. Uh, of course, without the poly stuff. Uh, but I'm sure many of you can use that 2 blocks, you know, uh, in a very effective manner. And it will help you to reduce some of the other pedals you have on the board as well. Okay, so uh, thank you Line6 for doing this for us. And uh, we hope you enjoy this video. If you did, give us a good thumbs up. Okay, like this video. Uh, subscribe to our channel and stay tuned for more of this kind of videos on Line 6 HX Storm and other products as well. Okay, so take care. God bless. I will see you real soon. Okay, bye-bye.